Hello everybody, hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a new video. Today I have got a Poundland haul for you. I found a few Christmas bargains from the land where everything used to be one pound, but not anymore. And I even found some 25p items that I've got to show you. And I've also got a few bits from Lidl. Again, a few bargain food items as well that you might be interested in. So if you like a bit of Poundland, a bit of Lidl and all of that good stuff, then stay tuned and I'll be showing you everything that I got. <laughs> And before we jump into the video, I want to show you my mug, which is a present from my friend Kate here on YouTube, Kate McCabe bought me this lovely mug, it's by Emma Bridgewater, and it has London at Christmas time on it, so we have the Regent Street lights on that side, and then around here, we go around to see Trafalgar Square and Tower Bridge, and some other famous sites in London bus there, so how lovely is that? So I'm going to have a quick sip of my coffee, I'm going to show you another present as well. Thank you, Kate, if you're watching. And Kate did a charity shop haul video in which she opened a few presents from me, a few thrifted things, in fact. So I'll link that video in the description box for you if you want to have a little watch of that. And I have another present here from my good friend Luke, who is also here on YouTube, Luke Catlow. And he got me this complete slow cooker recipe book. So it's got loads of fab recipes in here. It says over 100 tried and tested recipes plus expert advice and time saving tips. So as you may know I absolutely love using my slow cooker and it actually broke. It cracked unfortunately. So that one was no more. So I've actually just ordered a new one which has arrived and it is this one which is the crock pot slow cooker. So it says together since 1970. I know a lot of you call this the slow cooker a crock pot and I didn't realise that it was actually kind of like a brand so yeah I'm pleased to actually have kind of like the official crock pot to have a go with now. So this is the 3.5 litre one and it says it's dishwasher safe, easy to clean, safe bowl and lid and it's also an oven safe bowl as well which I think is really handy and this is a 3.7 litre capacity. Oh, that's pretty good going. So this one was actually a lot more reasonable than the 3.5 litre, I think it was. This one was £24.99. I think it's on offer at the moment. I got it from Amazon and it was delivered with Amazon Prime. So it arrived really quickly. So I'll link it in the description box if you want to get your hands on one of these. And yeah, I'll be making lots of delicious recipes using the cookbook. So thank you, Luke, for that. I absolutely love it. And I can't wait to get cracking with some of these because I normally just open tins and throw them in and hope for the best. So <laughs> it'll be nice to follow some actual recipes designed for the slow cooker. So let's start off, we'll start off with the things that I got in Lidl actually. So I got some real good bargains in there. I tell you what, if you're looking for some vegetables for your Christmas dinner, they have lots of good options in store at the moment. And they're all 14p, which is brilliant. So I think these are on offer until, I think it's until the 27th. So you've still got time if you want to get any of these. I think a lot of the big supermarkets do this kind of deal, don't they? But these are the ones that I picked up. They had these roasting potatoes, mini roasting potatoes for 14p for a huge bag like that. Then I also got some carrots. These again were 14p, British carrots, and you get a kilogram of those for 14p. The bag of potatoes is 1.5 kilograms. And then I got some Brussels sprouts. You get 500 grams. Again for 14p and a 500 gram bag of parsnips again for 14p. So some absolute bargains there. And I also picked up a few bottles of their car that I've stocked up and got three of these because these are currently on offer for I think £4.49 a bottle which is brilliant. And this car is really nice as well. I don't know if you've tried this one before but it's lovely. And I got this huge box of Fox's Fabulous Biscuit Selection. So this is a 550 gram box and this was 2 99 They also had kind of their own brand deluxe extra chocolatey biscuits for £3.29 I think it was, but you get more in this box. And so I went for this one. <laughs> but they both looked really good to be honest. And so I got all of that for 15 quid because I used the Little app so I had a two pound off voucher as well. I've been working with Little over on Instagram on their desserts, um, showcasing some of their dessert options, but this isn't sponsored or anything. I just love a bit of Little, as you probably know, because I've done a lot of Little hauls on here, haven't I? So if you've been here for a while, you probably know that already. So next up, um, let's have a look at all the stuff that I got from Poundland 
which is very exciting, because they've got a bit of a sale on at the moment. So I'll save the 25p items. Let's work down in price. The first thing I actually got was a pair of slippers. So these were four pounds from Pep & Co. They're these kind of fur-lined slippers and they've got kind of like a iridescent, is it leopard print going on? <laughs> I think that's what it is. Anyway, I've got these for my sister. She's coming over for Christmas. So I thought um, those would be nice for her to chill out around the house in. She'll probably hate them, but <laughs> I thought I'd get them her anyway. And yeah, I just thought for four pounds, they're a really nice pair of slippers, nice and cozy as well. And then I picked up a game that I thought might be quite a good fun thing for us to play. It's Who Am I for Christmas? So it's the game where you get a card and you pop one on your head and then you have to guess who you are by asking questions. Is that how you play it? I think it is. Classic guessing game includes uh, party hats and uh, 48 playing cards. Should we try one out just to see? And for one pound as well, I think that's brilliant. Okay, so you wear one of these hats, <laughs> like so. By the way, I've got the Santa hat on today because my hair wasn't a vibe and I thought I want to film the haul but I can't be bothered to sort my hair out today. I'm on the wind down now. Anyone else on the wind down? I said wind down, not wind down, although I might be getting some wine down me later. Um, so I am dot dot dot. Oh, there's nothing on it. You're meant to write it. Maybe you're meant to write them. Are these all blanks? No, they're not. You've got a spare one. I think you can write on that one if you wanted to. I feel like I shouldn't really look at them because then I'll be aware of options but there we are there's one here so we've got i am jacob marley oh i fancy watching the muppets christmas carol you know i am chitty bang bang i'm judy garland it's all kind of like christmas films and that sort of thing actually quite good to go through and play and then you might get some ideas of things you want to watch over christmas time so i'll pop that away but yeah for one pound i thought that's a really fun little game to play and there's four hats in there as well which is pretty good so a few of you can play that all at the same time next up i picked up some pens so these are dela rowney acrylic paint markers and i thought for one pound each these would definitely be worth um having a go with i've seen chelsea bowen use some nice paint pens she's got a really lovely set actually that i probably should just invest in I think it was quite reasonable in terms of how many pens she's got with that. But in the meantime, I thought these were pretty good for a quid each. So I've got them in silver, uh, gold, silver, and also, I'm showing you the complete wrong order here. <laughs> gold, black, and silver. Those were the only colors they had in store. And yeah, I just thought these would be quite good for the DIYs, doing a little bit of detail with paint when you don't want to like get all the paints and brush out. So next up I got this things to do pad. My to-do lists have been going crazy so I needed a new one of these and yeah I just love these ones. I've been using these style of to-do list pads for years now and I think they're brilliant and I love the fact that you can just tick things off, pop the date on, write your priorities out and just feel like you've got your life together even when you haven't. <laughs> Next up we have this. I haven't seen this before, but I thought this looked rather posh. It is the Signature Fudge, and I've gone for it in clotted cream. They also had a different flavor, and I don't know why I didn't just buy both when they're just a pound. I don't know why I left one behind, but sometimes that happens in pound and, doesn't it? You make mistakes. Anyway, <laughs> I probably live to regret that, but here we are with the clotted cream fudge, and you get 150 grams for one pound, which I think is fab. So next up, we're moving on to some 25p items. So they have had a bit of a sale starting in the Christmas area, and most of it was gift bags, gift wrap, a few window stickers, but there was also the odd ornament as well. I saw some little dogs, um, and maybe a couple of other things as well, little gift boxes and that sort of thing. But I went for some of these Christmas sacks. I've also got a load of gift bags to show you, but these are all really handy for gift wrapping presents. And as I haven't seen some people yet, I still have some presents to put into bags. So I thought that's a good way of kind of organizing the things I want to put together. And then they can get a sack um, as well. And anything else that I don't use, I'll just put it away for next year. <laughs> so um, this one was 25p and it says jumbo sack, absolutely no peaking. It's just this very kind of thin, almost like a felt um, material with a drawstring, but enough to gather all the presents in 
and yeah, it looks quite nice that, I thought. For 25p, we can't argue with that, can we? And then I got two of this kind, and this one says, Dear Santa, please bring presents. I have been extra good this year. I feel like Hermione did a DIY with this. I think she might have made a cushion, if I remember correctly. But um, yeah, really cool. I think the text looks pretty good on that. 25p again, really nice way um, to give somebody their presents with the nice drawstring as well. So I got two of that kind, and then I got some labels. These ones are really good if you've got a lot of people to wrap for, and you just want to smash through it, whack one of these on, because it has the to and from on the sticker. And I really like this kind of wolf um, design and the owl, Christmas tree, and then just the random stickers that you can also use if you want to cover up a bit of sellotape and that sort of thing. Or you could just use that if you had a bag just to kind of seal the bag up. And you get 100 stickers in here for 25p, again, absolute bargain. And then we have some more gift tags. In the similar range, I picked up these ones. So again, with the wolf designs and sweet little owls as well. And yeah, really nice. Again, just 25p and you get 40 in that. And then I got these ones, which have some really sweet little designs, kind of like Nutcracker um, characters and mice as well. And you get 40 of those, and again, just 25p for those. And then finally, on to some gift bags. They had absolutely loads reduced in store. The first one that I got was this one, and it says, um, Banter Claws, the original hipster. So we've got a um, hipster Santa, Santa Claus, <laughs> on that one, which I thought was really cool. So you have that, and then we have this one, which matches the gift tags that I've just shown you, and looks really good quality, I think, as well. It's got like the foiling going on as well, so you see that? Very, very nice. And then this one, I thought these were really sweet with the ballerina on. And this one has um, glitter going through it as well, which again, for 25p, I thought that was so good. So I've got two of those. And then these ones, which I feel like this design's been around for a while. I bought an apron with this um, design. It's got this really lovely watercolor design on it. It's also got um, glitter on all the snow as well. So really nice detail with the ribbon um, handles as well. And these were just 25p each too. So I stocked up on a few of those and yeah I'll be popping some presents into those for this year and I'll probably keep a few um, for next year as well so some real bargains down at Poundland if you are popping into store um, it's worth a little look I like the fact that this one <laughs> says it's Christmas in it <laughs> so yeah that is everything that I've got to show you from um, Lidl and from Poundland so I hope you enjoyed this little haul just as we're heading into Christmas. So it's the final countdown. Are we all feeling excited? How are we feeling? I hope you're all doing okay. Um, let me know in the comments how you're getting on this week. Um, I would love to hear from you all. So feel free to um, leave me a little comment down there and we'll have a little chat in the comments. I'm not sure what videos I've got coming for you. I really have no idea. I might do a clean with me. It'll be like a last minute, refresh the house for Christmas type of thing. If you fancy that, that might well be on its way. But yeah, I'm just having a nice week at home. I'm getting a few bits sorted out before the holiday properly begins. Still doing a little bit of work. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this haul. Um, if you did, of course, do give it a little thumbs up. And if you're new here, do click subscribe for new videos every single week. Don't forget, over on Instagram, you can win the H&M cushion cover with the tree on it that lots of you had your eye on. Um, that is over on my Instagram account, Mr. Carrington Home. If you want to head over there, there's a picture of that cushion cover and all the details will be over there of how you can win that if you would like to enter that. But yeah, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my coffee and I'll say goodbye. So thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in another video very soon. Bye.